We are live at Skin and D. Johnson Stadium in International Speedway in Baron Grizzlejock, Georgia. The Ork George cheering section is already in the spirit of things I can see. They've already dismembered the opposing team's mascot. <laughs> Nicely done, great fans. Did you know that being an NFL mascot is the leading cause of death for overqualified college graduates? Both teams hit the field ready to hit each other in this NFL matchup. Great Washington Cadavers battle. The Yorks of Hazard. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Fricks, do you smell something burning? Ah, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the toaster oven to warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Opa! Uh -huh. It's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take your shampoo and ouzo? Stick your head in the toaster oven. That'll warm you up. And it's first and ten. And he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Second down and more than the QB would like. All week the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Kapow! Third down and, well, good luck. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. Third down in the offense, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Third down in forever. for a nine-yard completion. They're moving the ball. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a run. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a thought they'd snags. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. First and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And he runs into the end zone. 
for a touchdown. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! First and ten. And with a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. And it's first and ten. for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. First and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the... And this rep is definitely on the take. That was a bogus penalty. They're back up here on first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. <laughs> first down in a mile. a run for no gain. Second down in a mile. Oh, great 
tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Third down and never going to happen. He had it for a second there. Couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Look out. That's an all-out attack on the... If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just gonna say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three! And they run it for a couple of yards. I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, eight. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. First and ten. Second down and long. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Third down and long. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. 
And it's first and ten. You know, a lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the grounds crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And that'll be second and eight to go. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. Second down in a lot. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. And he laterals the ball. Man, these guys like. That's a four yard gain. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And they call a ginormous dirty trick. He's so big at the Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Banji, the new game from Wilton Crabtree. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. First down! They used their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's 
It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> kids to think I'm cool. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. down you got to get right back up and fight yeah, what about when you get knocked up what do you do then run Pow! and how about a little dirt sandwich and it's first and ten that my friends was an all-pro NFL hit And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, with the punishing hit. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Ah, oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy! Oh, sure, now we... Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over! Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just caught blocked the clock. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh boy, where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, gonna go to a strapeze show? Where are we going? Hey, why don't you settle down, just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Pet your rabbit. <laughs> when you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Full man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night locked up for solicitation. And that'll be second down and four. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh, that guy? Oh, he's a dead one. Oh, that one over there. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky 
sneaky fast ham and sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. Like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double submarine from Taco Hell. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. Three. And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. The return. Be careful. Try to pick up a ball when it's in the middle of a bunch of bloody body parts. It's so unsanitary. I once tried to return a guy's kidney for a touchdown. How'd that go? Uh, the ref gave me one point since I spiked it and split it. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Second down and five. First and ten. And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about ten on that play. Hey, he makes up a name for himself every night. 
That's how he stays ahead of the bounty hunters. He's monitored in 50 states. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. And he sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. You've got to catch that. Third and two. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. I won. Hot two, hot. It looks like the defense handed our Schlitt. Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. That kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps on sides and attacks the QB. You know, in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, yeah. they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. I, I, one, I. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. I. If you can't get the sack, that's the next best thing. Third down and ten. I. Hot one, hot two. Hey. That was a nice piece of running, Grim. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hey. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hey. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. I, I. 
He had it for a second there. Third down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. First down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Just a great run for a touchdown. And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Glenn. Captain. And he plows forward for the two-point conversion. for that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, he should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. Should have, and there's an eight yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes, I like it. Like a patient prison break. Second down and two. A nice run there for eight yards. Second down and two. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. And that'll bring up third and one. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. scrimmage well this kick is no guarantee sure it is if he misses he's fired guaranteed he is automatic nice kick boring just get the points and let's move on <laughs> The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first. 
first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. All right, don't get covered in your ears, Bricks, because now the Sonic Blast dirty trick. Yep. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on... Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I uh, tap off my drink. What did I do with it? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot... There was an explosion, but everyone's walking away from it. Them cool guys always walk away from explosions. Hey, that might be good for the movies, but it's awful for the MFL. Hot one. Hot. First down. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw the. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Hot two, hot three. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. The offense goes into their two minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry up offense, you moron. I am so confused. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Man, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Timeout remaining. The defense has to get something going here. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. timeouts the D needs to stop this is intense no grin can't think it's intense <laughs> get it idiot third down and the offense needs a miracle and that's a run for no gain then it's not really a run is it boring but smart time to punt whoa whoa you can't say that on the radio and he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Briggs. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. The Orcs of Hazard win the game today.
The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the scotch, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrill with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it.